guys today we are going to magic kingdom to see the fireworks i have been dying to see happily ever after so that's the plan we're getting ready to head out shortly but i just want to show you my outfit really quick and then i'm going to try to get on a few rides but tonight i'm really just going to see happily ever after i'm gonna bring you guys along with me it's not gonna be a whole lot because it's already like kind of late <laughs> y'all i've been resting this trip so yeah, well, let me show you what I'm wearing. Okay, so I'm wearing this Minnie Mouse shirt that I actually got from City Trends. You guys seen it in a haul. And then I have a black little tennis skirt. And I was going to wear those pink shoes right there. I was going to wear those, but y'all, these shoes have been so comfortable. So I'm just wearing these. And then I have my little Mickey Mouse bag. I done had this for years. I have a duffel bag that match. And then we got Mickey attached. Got a couple little bracelets. I got to get my magic band on. And that's it. All right, guys. So let's go to Magic Kingdom. Okay, guys. I have finally made it to Magic Kingdom. The bus ride was smooth. I met a lady who I talked to her, her mom, and now her sister and her husband. <laughs> two little kids. We kept, like, running to each other on the buses. So... We hung out and talked on the bus for a while. Oh, it's looking very cloudy. I hope it don't rain because <laughs> I left my umbrella. Because every time I go through the security check, I get checked because of the umbrella. So, yeah. <laughs> so, um, yeah, we're getting ready to go through the security check again. And I'll see you guys inside in the castle. Yay! Y'all, it's been a great trip. When I tell you, I have been having a blast. Uh -huh. It's been fun. <laughs> I love the buses. I love the Coco bus. <laughs> so cute. Okay. <laughs> Confectionery. It's a candy shop. And then... And that's the Emporium store. Okay, so we're walking right down the middle of Main Street, USA. <laughs> it feels so good to be home. Yo, this is my house. This is where I live. Okay. It's so cool. It's so awesome. And it's a nice breeze tonight. It's humid, but it's a nice breeze. That's cool too. <laughs> oh, he got a haircut. <laughs> he got his first haircut. They cheering him on. <laughs> oh, so cool. It's a crowd tonight, but look at Cinderella's castle. So pretty. There's Casey's Corner. Famous for hot dogs. Right, so I am um, just walking around. I'm gonna grab something to eat probably soon. I don't know because now I'm starting to get kind of hungry. But have you guys been to Magic Kingdom? If so, what's your favorite ride? I like the Thunder Mountain and keep them over. <laughs> and also, if you haven't come to Disney yet, what do you think you want to do when you do come here? Well, let me know in the comments. Squash that. I had to find a spot for the fireworks because they start in like 40 minutes. So I'm gonna sit here for like an hour. Where do wait for the fireworks to start? But um, yeah, I didn't want to like lose the spot. I need somewhere to kind of sit down a little bit. You know, this is very uncomfortable. But yeah, for an hour. We're gonna sit here and wait for the fireworks. Y'all see that castle? It's lighting up because it's getting dark. It's so cute. The kingdom at night is so pretty. All the people, y'all. So packed. <laughs> 
So while I'm waiting for the fireworks, I've been getting um, asked questions on Facebook, like, what is it like going solo? How am I enjoying it? So I figure I'll answer it right now. I'm gonna also answer it later, but hey, we got a few minutes till it get completely dark, as you can see. Um, <laughs> so it's it's been easy. It's been good. Like I can do what I want when I want. I don't have to worry about people whining and complaining. I don't want to do this. And I walk slow and I'm in pain. So when I need to sit down, I can sit down. When I need to stop, I can stop. When I need to keep going, I keep going. So that's the beauty part of it. Um, I haven't really felt lonely yet. So. I mean, even at the restaurants, it was, and it's a nod, it was like a little weird, but my waitress kept coming, she knew I was by myself, so she kept coming over to talk to me, so. It wasn't was bad, and actually, um, I've been meeting a lot of people on the buses coming over to here, or in the parks, actually I'm talking to a lady right now with her family. They're talking and they're teachers, so you know. Um, <laughs> what else? Um, yeah, I'm just in this one family. I keep seeing them on the buses every time we get on the bus. So we've just been talking. When I'm in the restaurants, I talk to the people who sit next to me. They started talking to me, or because of my birthday button, they'll say happy birthday, and then we talk about being July birthdays and it's hot in July and all this stuff. So it's not too bad. If you wanted to go solo, give it a try. We'll talk about it more later. I'm going to um, take another break until it gets completely dark and show you guys the fireworks. You gotta be in, you gotta be in place. People were in place at eight o'clock. Yeah, cause you gotta, if you wanna get. Yeah. Right. It's, it's been packed. Right. Yeah. Uh, right. Exactly. <laughs> I think that's a good area. I mean, you can see it real good. And if we need to, we can step out. Oh, he's so cute. The baby's so cute. <laughs> oh, she's so cool. Okay. Let me, um, I'm going to stand up and stretch a little bit. So. <laughs> she, um, she was saying, the lady was saying that she wanted to ride Big Thunder Mountain after this and that's exactly what I want to do so I'll probably go over there with them um, but she was saying like, she wanted to stay back a little bit because there's too many people in the front and she wanted them to be in her personal space she was talking to her kids about personal boundaries and space and she's like that's why I'm mean, just a teacher she's like yeah I'm a teacher we, we there's three teachers here so we, we, gonna, we work on space and boundaries because some of them not because it's somebody on me right now. That's okay. <laughs> so, it's a little kid. <sighs> like, literally on me, so. <laughs> no, you can see. Like, all uh, on me. <laughs> but anyway, man, um, it's starting to get a little bit more darker, so. Yay! I'm getting excited. Thank you very much. That's very nice of you. <laughs> yeah, we short. <laughs> They just asked us if we want to stand in front of me if I want to stand in front of them so I can see. Because it's going to start. So I got to lean on here because that'll be my back. It's hard to get over. And they just made the cast a little darker. It's going to start in five minutes. Oh, so excited. I've been happily ever after in so long. Alright. I know y'all tired of me talking. Y'all want to go and see the fireworks? Okay. We're going to show y'all. And when you're brave enough to listen, and bold enough to pursue, that dream will lead us on a journey to discover who we're meant to be. All we have to do is look inside our hearts and unlock the magic within. Smoke and sing that we're meant 
grab hold of your dreams and make them come true. For you are the key to unlocking your own magic. Now go, let your dreams guide you. Reach out and find your happily ever after. So I'm like, I'll just wait till I come back to the food court. And I didn't want no KC hot dogs. I don't even like hot dogs like that unless they on the grill. So, and I'm gonna pay $15 and $13 for no hot dogs that I want to go eat. So I came back and I got the same thing I had earlier. This time they gave us pickles and lettuce and tomatoes. So, but I got the bacon cheeseburger and fry. And then the lemon blueberry cheese 
cheesecake with the uh, making cookie. So that's what I'm having for a late night dinner tonight. It's like 11 o'clock, y'all. I don't need to be eating this, but I haven't eaten since earlier today, and so I'm starving. All right, so I'm um, gonna go back to the room. I'm gonna close it out and uh, talk to y'all. So I just want to let y'all know what was going on. I was trying to show the fireworks on live, but somebody called me and interrupted. Anyways, my daughter's calling me. I'll call you. And action! Because we're at All Star Movie. <laughs> just kidding. But we finally made it in the room. And I just got in my pajamas. Y'all, this is my pajamas that inspired this trip. This is my Vera Bradley. Sorry, it's a little wrinkle here. But this is my Vera Bradley Cinderella pajamas. I have shorts. And this is the reason why I'm here. Because I saw these shorts, this pajama set, and I was like, I miss Disney. Like, it hit me, like, real hard. And I just really miss Disney. I was actually buying from next year. And I was like, no, why wait? Why not? take a day. but anyway um today tonight was excellent minus my aches and pains my back was hurting a little bit so i didn't get to ride any of the rides that i wanted to ride i wanted to do big thunder mountain i didn't feel like walking way over there so i did push myself to walk some other places earlier but i didn't get to ride anything but the main thing reason why I wanted to go tonight was to see Happily Ever After. Happily Ever After. That's the best fireworks show. When you watch Disney fireworks show, baby, you don't want to see no other fireworks. Because, let's see, they do not live up to the hype. You know what I'm saying? So, but anyway, it was good. And like I said, I got to meet a lot of people. All the ladies and a couple of gents that was around us, they were... We was talking all night, so, you know, it was a lady, she was with like four other people, maybe five, and then a couple of kids, they were from Louisiana, and then it was a lady and her son, he was like 12, and then her husband, I don't know where he came from, he was, it was just her forever, and then he just popped up, <laughs> they were from North Carolina, South Carolina, and then... There was some people next to us with the little girl who kept laying on me. And she kept messing with my purse. Like, I had my little Mickey Mouse on my purse. She kept messing with my purse. I'm like, baby, what are you doing? So I just stuck my Mickey Mouse inside my purse because she was, she kept laying on me. <laughs> I was like, and then, so it was funny because the lady in the yellow, she was like telling her sons, respect people's boundaries. Do not, you know, invade people's spaces. And then that little girl was all in my boundaries. She didn't care. But they, um... She had, they had three little girls. They was literally like, I want to say she was two. The other one's like maybe four and five or something like that. But anyway, it was a good night. Um, I just was so happy to see the castle, you know. Um, and my allergies are acting up really bad. Look how bad my eyes are. My allergies been acting up real bad. My nose has been running. I've been sniffing a lot. <sighs> but other than that, oh, it was hot. It was hot. But will I come back again in July? I don't know. Probably not. I don't know, child. <laughs> I just really want to go celebrate my birthday this time. Like, I just really want to be here. And it just feels so great. This has been a beautiful week. Beautiful week. So, yeah, I hope you guys enjoy hanging out with me. I know we didn't do a whole, whole lot tonight besides the fireworks. And then my darling husband called me right in the middle of the fireworks. Now I was trying to go live and I kept losing signal. And I was like, you know what, whatever. So I hope you guys enjoyed the bits and pieces of Happily Ever After um, fireworks that I got for you. Yeah, sorry about that. Oh, this girl, she bumped my arm and I'm like, y'all look kids. These parents need to control their kids better. Even here at movies. We was getting ready to come on the elevator. There's eggs all on the ground. What? That's some of the little Brazilian kids. I see people complain about them in the, you know, the Facebook groups, the Disney Facebook group. Baby, they, <laughs> them little boogers is right here. There's like three or four of them rooms. 
they've been cutting up. When I say cutting up, they've been cutting up. Running up and down, screaming, hollering. Security was literally met us at the elevator and apologized for their behavior. And he's like, if you see some police report, that's oh, you ain't got to worry about me. I called immediately. Okay. So, but anyway, other than um, it's been a great trip. This has been like one of my favorite Disney trips so far. It's been just relaxing, peaceful. I've been doing what I felt like doing. If I didn't feel like doing something, I didn't do it, which I'm sad about because I really want to go to Disney Springs and I did not do that. But I didn't feel like doing all that walking. I was aching. So, but anyway. Sorry, y'all. I don't know what happened to this part, but my camera just shut off. <laughs> but if you guys enjoyed hanging out with me tonight, don't forget to subscribe and hit that like button. Comment down below to let me know that you are here. I am so glad that you are here joining me for my Disney vacation trip. And I will see you guys on the next video. I love you guys. Have a good night. Bye.